Hi, my name is Chris Hudson with Martin Deerline. Uh, we're just going to talk about feeder chain adjustment. Uh, over the years, John Deere has changed from the traditional feeder house to a 4x4 feeder house. Um, this is the S series combine with a 4x4 feeder house. Um, there's a gauge, a sight gauge on the side here with a notch. Uh, basically, when the belts or the chain's tight, you want to have that washer sitting right in that groove right there. So you tighten this nut with a 30 mil wrench and then after that's tight you want to have a look on the side here and just see what kind of gap you have on either side. If this bolt and washer is right tight against this side of the feeder house there's a good chance that your chain's getting really tired. Uh, might be a good idea to replace the chain. Uh, okay, so on this style of feeder house, this goes all the way from the 8820 all the way up to the 9870s. Um, for this one, you got to open up and access through the top door on the feeder house here. And then you loosen the jam nut off, and then you adjust your feeder chain via these two adjusting nuts. And then you adjust your chain on both sides until the feeder house chain just starts coming off the slat underneath just so it makes a nice V just coming off the slat there with the chain. Uh, do the same thing on each side and again just double check your gap on either side to make sure they're fairly close to the same on each side of the combine.